Do you want this? With a new baby comes unexpected challenges. <gasps> Say hello. <laughs> But baby Hudson's condition was something unimaginable. He was born with bladder extrophy, where the bladder formed outside of the body. The most striking feature is, is that the bladder is literally inside out, and it's protruding up through uh, a gap in the abdominal muscles and in the skin. Doctors John Krieger and Travis Groth are two of Hudson surgeons at Children's, their team breaking ground with a first-of-its-kind operation. If we're able to um, reconstruct a normal anatomy, they're going to have a, a very functional, normal life. The surgeons worked closely with two other renowned children's hospitals, Philadelphia and Boston. The teams traveled to each case to watch, assist, and learn. Our three teams now more than triple the, the experience we have together. So we're doing more of these cases than we ever have before by collaborating. A surgery like this takes at least eight hours. Imagine that for an 11-week-old. The Bobbers say they are grateful to the team here at Children's for treating Hudson like one of their own. They cared for him like it was their own child. You know, they, they didn't put him in a crib and roll him to the OR. They carried him to the OR and, you know, it was that extra touch. Hudson's dad says he hopes their case helps others in the future. We hope that you continue exactly what you're doing. You're on the right path. Look at us. We're going to be going home in a couple days. Heading home for Hudson to start life with his family. In Wauwatosa, Melinda Davenport, WISN 12 News. And doctors at Children's say there is no known cause for extrophy. It occurs four to eight weeks after a woman becomes pregnant. It's not caused by something the mother did or didn't do while she was pregnant, nor is it hereditary.